Welcome back. We are here looking at the U.S. indexes. We're going to look at the S&P 500, the Dow Jones, and the Nasdaq. And this is going to be my daily forecast for Wednesday, October 21st, 2020. If you'd like to support the channel, you're welcome to hit the subscriber button down here in the corner. That really helps this channel to grow and we'll add more content as this channel is growing. Uh, hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. So we are are at the moment just waiting for the news whether or not there is going to be additional stimulus or not. If there's going to be additional stimulus, then this market will absolutely explode to the upside. If not, then this market will most likely collapse towards the 100 moving average. So what we may, may see is that we first of all will test these highs of uh, 3,549 before going to the highest here of 3,588. Uh, we most likely will find massive resistance here at, at the point. At the moment, we are finding support at the 20 exponential moving average at 3,432. We have rallied a little bit today. We're up around 0.72%. Uh, a breakdown below the 50 moving average opens the door to the 100 moving average at 3,289. If there's no stimulus, then we most likely will go lower. We expect, do expect Maria to uh, a lot of buyers to come in here, but it could mean a complete collapse towards the 200 moving average at 3,000 to uh, three, $3,135 and maybe also lower. Um, because there will not be an additional stimulus for a really, really long time. And there's no guarantee how the market will basically uh, react if that is the case. You could all expect the next stimulus to be next year, in February. If you look technical indicator for uh, for the S&P 500, we can see that the RS, uh, MACD is about to cross the signal line. The RSI is technically flat at this point. The CCI showing signs of a trend change to the downside. And the same goes for the stochastic. And the Bollinger Band is showing, uh, it's basically there's a lot of room to the downside. I would not be surprised if we saw a massive move to the downside uh, if there is no stimulus. That is almost guaranteed that is going to happen. Uh, but... Even though we get a stimulus, there is no guarantee that this market will just completely uh, recover to something similar to this, where we're back on track to higher and higher highs. So if we look at the Dow Jones, we can see that we have rallied 0.71%. We have found support at the uh, 28,226 uh, and... At this point, it's the same thing. We're waiting for stimulus confirmation. We will first of all, if we go to the upside, test this level at $28,972. And then we'll go to these highs of $29,199. A break below the 50-moving uh, average will open the door to the 100-moving average at 27169 Technical indicators are very similar to the S&P 500, a little bit worse, actually. Uh, MACD is about to cross the signal line. RSI is showing the bearish momentum. The same goes for the CCI, the stochastic, and the, the Bollinger Band has a lot of room to the downside. If this moving average breaks, then watch out below. So if we look at the NASDAQ, we can see that we are basically standing still. There is a mix. I did a video previously about the tech stocks. Uh, there is a mix of how the tech stocks are doing. Some are doing well, some are doing bad. And of course, that affects this market significantly. Uh, if you look at the technical indicators, they are favoring the downside for the NASDAQ. However, I do believe that, sorry, I do believe that the 50 moving average will be absolutely enormous. Uh, support as we saw down here. Uh, but if it breaks, that will open the door to the 100 moving week average at 10,934. Uh, uh, but if we break up from here, if there is additional stimulus, then we will go to 12,187 uh, and then we'll go to these all time highs of uh, 12,439. It is all about stimulus at this point. 
a good idea just to hang out, don't make any major moves because this can basically completely collapse if there's no stimulus and can shoot absolutely to the upside if, we, if there is stimulus. So, yes, good luck. Hope you find this video helpful and you're welcome to subscribe uh, to click on this button, hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. Good luck and thank you very much. Thank you.